Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to be reacting to another one of Tom McDonald's many, many songs that you guys have been asking me to react to. It's featuring Dax. I will, as always, link their channels and this video in the description below. Okay, this song was made three years ago. Got 5.9 million views. This is Blame the Rapper. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a rapper, but I'm losing my respect for the genre. How many songs about Xanax and alcohol are we dropping? How many kids we gonna kill for we admit it's a problem? Probably stop if it was one of our sons or one of our daughters. We know our demographic is primarily youth. We glorify breaking the law to children in school. Kids copy what we see and imitate what we do. They'll go to jail for doing the things you thought them was cool. We put women in our videos exploding their bodies. While little girls around the world grab their phone and they watch it. They need a realistic role model, not just a Barbie. They see strippers and escorts, but no lawyers or doctors. Hey! says I'm a rapper, but I'm losing my respect for the genre. How many songs about Xanax and alcohol are we dropping? How many kids are we gonna kill for we admit it's a problem? Probably stop if it was one of our sons or one of our daughters. We know our demographic is primarily youth. We glorify breaking the law to children in school. Kids copy what we say and imitate what we do. They'll go to jail for doing the things you told them was cool. They're just kind of messed up. There's just a lot released out there um, talking about the same stuff, really. It's either drugs, sinning, you know, or yeah, kids do copy what we say and what we do and not all kids are sheltered. So a lot of these kids, what ends up happening is they see these, this stuff and then yeah, they thought it was, they thought it was cool, but they went to jail. We put women in our videos exploiting their bodies while little girls around the world grab their phone and watch it. I don't watch music videos very often, especially for a lot of the like regular rap song. Because I've only watched a few and I noticed that all of them have freaking women in barely any clothing and they're just twerking and stuff and it's like, I don't want to see that, bruh. He says they need a realistic role model, not just a Barbie. They see strippers and escorts, but no loyal. I can't speak today. No lawyers or doctors. Hey, hip hop, what the hell happened? It was power to the people and we like that stuff. These days you're promoting that it's fun to be an addict. So I'm asking, how could y'all write that, bruh? Um, because they are themselves and they're promoting that it's fun to be an addict, that it's cool, that it, you know, where did the re, like, where did the important stuff go? Where did the relatable stuff go? It was power to the people and we like that stuff. These days you're promoting that it's fun to be an addict. So I'm asking, how could y'all write that, bruh? You can blame the rapper if you blow up But your favorite song are about doing drugs So what happens after these kids grow up And who's to blame for who they've become They made it look so cool to shoot those guns Dude, <laughs> I kind of, this kind it kind of made me giggle because, because how they're singing it, it's like, it kind of reminds me of like sad Coldplay songs or something. Like it, it goes from rap to suddenly like, <laughs> blame the rappers that you blow up, but your favorite songs are about doing drugs. So what happens after these kids grow up and who's to blame for who they've become? They made it look so cool to shoot those guns and hate the cops and get too drunk. You can't blame the rappers when you show up. Love the songs that make you dumb. You can't blame the rappers. Oh, but we can. We can. And we will. That make you dumb. You can blame yeah. the Making music is a privilege and a choice. And if you ever get to be successful, you must understand the people that you influence. I swear by what you say and that the melodies you sing make wings, build dreams, and fill voids. We got medication straight through voice. Some give life and some destroy. And even though this money seems nice, it can't come. So we must take that as a hit that there's other things in life we should enjoy. We move mountains. We cross states. We play roles in presidential debates. So don't you try and tell me making music is for fun. And you don't care about the things that our music helped make. Man, I know I'm not perfect, but I'll change. I'm the outcome of this world. World's in my pain and this music is pills and I promise this dose that you take won't make you say. 
talking about how making music is such a privilege. Having people come and watch and come and listen to your songs, like we are medication straight through voice. Some give life and some destroy. Even though this money seems nice, it can't come, so we must take that as a hint that there's other things in life you should enjoy. The people that you influence are swayed by what you say. The songs are talking about how the rapping industry is so messed up. And, and others. Hip-hop and rap, it influences people and make people think that these things are okay, when essentially it's opening the gate to the demons, right? Music should be a way to help people. So don't try and tell me making music is for fun. Dax and, you know, the whole hog gang, they do not make music for fun. They make music to help people wake up. Make you say, you can blame the rappers that you blow up. artists can't even talk they just mumble the lyrics and the teenagers listen while they rebel from their parents while the rappers tell them pop a pill by gucci and wear it they say screw the police break the rules smoke weed buy some shoes you don't need rep the hood in your street all these rappers holding guns and now the kids want some mess around and kill a homie you can't clean that blood we encourage being stupid with our music and we're normalizing poor moral standards while we do it little boys see the way that women look on our videos and assume it's real life project that image on little girls it's unrealistic if you're young and you listen you are one in a million you are loved you are different hey hip-hop I know life moves on, but while I'm here, how could you write that, dog? Bro, when they, when he said that, you know, the rappers just m mumble their lyrics. There's so many songs that do, and that's music, right? Or they use a lot of auto-tune as well, and it's like, what? Teenagers listen while they rebel from their parents, while the rappers tell them, pop a pill, buy Gucci, and wear it. They say, screw the police, break the rules, smoke weed, buy some hoes, you don't need to rep the hood, and your street. All these rappers holding guns, and now kids want some. Little boys see the way that women look in our videos and assume that it's real life, project that image on little girls. Um, yeah, it's unrealistic. It also just shows how we should treat women as well. And then they get disappointed when girls wear more to cover up, right? I don't know, anyway. You can blame the rappers that you blow up. Nova Rockefeller, as always. The whole video basically summarizes rap and hip hop right now, how much it's influencing little kids and just people in general. There is better rap out there. Anyway, guys, I will link this video in the description below. If you guys want me to react to more videos like this, give me a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I love you, and I will see you in the next one. Bye! Three, I do.
I want them. Oh, it always takes so long to load. <laughs> and there's adverts! Again, every single time. I don't have YouTube Premium, guys. 